Nailcut Hall in the British Midlands was the venue for this year's Farm Foods British Par 3 Championship. The 36-hole Pro-Am competition is played over two days and there's almost £50,000 up for grabs in prize money. Over 5,000 spectators were there to watch the pros and the celebrities take on this challenging Par 3 test. The event is known for its relaxed atmosphere and has grown into one of the premium par 3 contests in the world. Hosting the tournament, former European Ryder Cup captain Tony Jacklin. It was sort of accidental, I suppose. They wanted to try and upgrade it a little bit uh, with a, 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 a name that was maybe known a bit better. And so I've been, it's been good. We, we, we have raised the profile of the event, I think, over the last... Uh, four or five years and uh, we've had fun doing it. The championship is certainly fun and you'll find different generations coming together at Nailcut to enjoy the family atmosphere. But the week has a serious side as well, raising funds for the Rainbows Hospice for children and young people. Former snooker legend Willie Thorne is involved in the fundraising. Well, I'm a patron of Rainbow Children's Hospice and uh, that's where all the charity, we do, we do gala dinners on two, uh, three of the four nights and obviously everything we do auction-wise, uh, raffle-wise, uh, silent auction-wise goes to Rainbow Children's Hospice and they've got to get the best part of 4.1 million per year just to stay open. So Rick has very, very kindly let me use our, our charity as it were and as a company, Champions has uh, given the best part of a quarter of a million in the last few years just from, from dues like this, from events we've put forward. The Pro-Am event attracted a pretty high-profile field of young pros, amateurs and celebrities. European tour player Scott Jamieson was there, along with Charlie Hull, a rising star of the women's game. And among the famous sportsmen, Manchester United former goalkeeper Peter Schmeichel, completing the picture at Nailcut, all the amateur players who got the chance to play alongside some of their sporting heroes in a once-in-a-lifetime experience they are unlikely to forget. Oh, amazing. What an experience, the, the legend that is Tony Jacklin. Uh, just an honour to play with him, really. It's this sort of event which really gives the likes of myself and, and Robin a, a fantastic opportunity to play with the legends of the game. Speaking of legends, spectators were excited to see former Ryder Cup player and captain and major champion Ian Woosnam, who enjoyed the testing par 3 course. It's been great. The course is a great little course. The uh, first time I played, playing off the mats, a good mats, but uh, the ball just goes a little further and uh, I find it difficult to get the right distances really. And uh, I shot level par, quite happy with that. Uh, you know, maybe next year if I come to play, I can do better. He'll need to go some if this year's winner is anything to go by. Veteran DJ Russell took the title with a record-breaking eight underscore and the first prize check for £15,000.